Hi, I'm Joe from Cheap Joe's, and I'm here today with Joyce Faulkner. Hi, how are you? <laughs> One of my favorite, favorite artists in the whole world, and a fabulous teacher. They just, people love you so much. Oh, thank you they so do. much. You have, a, you have the best reputation. Really? Oh, you oh, do. Thank you have you. to know. You do, you do, you do. It's wonderful. <laughs> I hear that from my family, but this is great hearing it from you. Well, thank you. We, we just love having you here. Your classes fill quickly. Wow. But they're fun. You they make fun. it fun. Uh, just today, someone in her class, she's here teaching this week, and someone in her class told me that very thing, same thing that some artists take themselves so seriously. Right. And Joyce is not that way. She's, she even changed curriculum in the middle of the week this <laughs> week did, yes. to accommodate her students over there. Yes. And her work is unbelievable. We're going to show you a whole series. You saw some before we started this just now. And you're going to see others. I want to show you one. Oh. That this is, this is fairly typical, I think. Yes. Of her style. Uh, the work is just an overwhelmingly beautiful painting on watercolor paper that stretched on stretcher strips. And can we yes. talk about that a minute? Yes, we can. Yeah, sure. I think you're the only person I've ever known to work this I way. I am. I think you are. I am, I yes. think you're the creator of this process. I would like to take claim to that, mm -hmm. but I know there's bits and pieces that I picked up along the way of somebody varnishing a watercolor and then somebody stretching watercolor paper on stretcher bars. Uh -huh. And I put the two together. Um, I don't believe I had seen that before. And once I had finished the book, I knew I was going to uh, go in that direction. And I started stretching my own canvases, and I just thought this is, it was ideal for my style. Yeah. And no cost in framing, so. Yes, and they're lightweight. They you are don't, lightweight. You don't have the glass to contend yes. with. Right. So I think it's fabulous what yes. you've done. Thank you very much. Yeah, I, I just think it's it's a, one of those things. It's a little unusual. It puts you, you know, it's, it se separates you apart from the other watercolorists. Yes. Would you mind telling our people uh, what you've done, the videos that they can watch? Oh, sure. And see? Yes. On YouTube, if you uh, just type in Joyce Faulkner, and that's F-A-U-L-K-N-O-R, uh, type in Joyce Faulkner stretching canvas and varnishing. There's two videos. One is of me stretching the canvas, and it was shot here at Cheap Joe's. And there's another uh, separate video with me varnishing, and you see the products, and you see I, I go through it step by step. So it's oh, just that super. easy. Yeah. I'm yeah. going to go watch them too. Oh, are you? <laughs> I am. Absolutely, I am. And I watch yours as well. <laughs> oh, thank you. Well, tell me, how you've been painting a long time. I have been painting a long time. Since you were a child? Yes. Did you yes. study art in school? I did. Where, I did. Where did you go? I went to the Academy of Art in San Francisco. Oh, wow. Yes, I did. I just... Top yeah, notch. Yes, it was great. It I is. um I just thought that that would be just such a, so much fun. And I was always in commercial art, and computers came along. And I knew I wanted to still be hands-on, and so I went back to the academy and I studied illustration. Then I fell in love with watercolor. Wow, what a great story. Thanks. <laughs> and, and your work is just, out, it's just outstanding. Thank you. It really oh, is. Thank just you so unbelievable. much. unbelievable. Thank really. you. Now t tell me something else, if you will. I know that sometimes I will be traveling, or sometimes I'm not traveling, and something grabs me, and I yeah. think there's I want to do That's that it. scene. It's yeah. a landscape. It's a, a fishing rod, maybe, yeah. that I would love to paint because yes. I love to fish. Yeah. Or fish. What, what excites you? Well, it ch it's changing for me at this point in time. I could tell you when um, my last passion was all about glass. It's the facets of the light that bounces through the, the uh, piece of glass that hits the tabletop. And it could be something as simple as a salt and pepper shaker. You know, on the table, I can l lose myself and I have to be careful yeah. because if I'm with a group of people, you want to stay engaged. But if the light's hitting it just so and you have to think about the whole prism and, and, and the whole, how, how, you, how are you going to paint that? I think of it as a big math problem. And oh, I'm always going left to problem. right. Yeah, instead of the, the right brain working, it's always a left and right issue for me and um, I like breaking down the geometric shapes and that's what I find most fascinating. 
How exciting. Now, will you then photograph that if you have a chance? Mm -hmm. And then you'll work from the photograph. Yes. You'll do a sketch. Yes. And then you'll transfer that sketch to your stretched paper. Yes. And then you meticulously fill yes. in. Yes. Yes, right. but I do, I find all my darks first. Mm -hmm. And generally for watercolors, they go uh, light, to, light dark. to dark. Yes. And I go dark to light. And it's just one of those uh, compelling things that I was always mixing up my darks and I always wanted to lay them down and, and and I always felt, well, I'm a watercolor, so that's not how you do it. Um, but I f found the best of both worlds. And I was able to lay everything down with the darks and, uh, and then just glaze in right. with uh, all the color that I want. Well, they're fabulous. Thank you. H how many workshops will you do a year? One. Just one? I do Here yours. Here at Cheap Joe? Yeah. <laughs> I love it. One. You spoiled me. Watch the schedule, folks. She'll be back. I will be back. Yes, you will. Yes, Absolutely. I'm signed up for 2015. Absolutely. <laughs> so, I know. I just, you, you spoiled me. And, and I am at a different part of my career now, so I'm not teaching as much. Um, and tra the whole traveling part, so I'm staying home a little bit more and working on different projects. Well, we are honored. Thank you, and I'm I mean honored that. to We're be here. We're sincerely honored to have oh. <laughs> Joyce Faulkner here with us. And what a treat it has been this whole week coming in and going and watching Thank what you. you're doing in the class. They just love her to death. So <laughs> be sure you check out Joyce's website for her art. I bet you can buy, I bet you can buy some stuff from your website. I bet you could. Yeah. Yeah. It's arttoart.us. Arttoart.us. Yes. Thank you so much. Thank you, Joe. Thank I you. I just love being here. <laughs> Thank we you. love having you. Thank you.